there's a new tokenized commodity exchange, which is built as an easy and safer way to have exposure to commodities. And so with me is Samayan Sheikh, the founder and CEO of Fetch.ai, and then also Metalex. So kind of explain, Hamayan, how Fetch, Metalex, falls into Fetch, and then we'll talk a little bit more about the exchange. Yeah, hi. Thank you, Jane. Um, so Fetch is building the, the underlying technology, and uh, we are building multiple uh, protocols and multiple tools which you can use to actually uh, build commercial applications on top. And Metalex is one of those commercial applications where you can create your own instruments and you can trade your own instruments. You don't need counterparties. You are trading with a smart contract and you can create exposure. You can you can hedge exposure in a decentralized exchange. You can actually buy and sell and trade the exposure without the need for a counterparty. Okay. So this, the Metalex is an exchange using Fetch's technology. So there may be other things besides an exchange that Fetch would be used for, which I know we've talked about, but this is just one application. Yes, this is, a, this is more a, a, a DeFi application, which um, we, we see a lot of people, a lot of traders and my background in commodities. It's very difficult to actually um, take illiquid commodities and create any uh, volume around it. Um, most of the exchanges probably won't even list such commodities in, in the way. It's very cumbersome. It's got very... Um, archaic uh, method of trading. Mm -hmm. So what we're doing is we're bringing it um, into the DeFi space. So you could be uh, creating new types of instruments. You could be creating new types of hedging instruments. So for risk management instruments, and you can then uh, create the market around it. And, and, and the best bit is you don't have a centralized entity which is in control. So you don't have a counterparty risk either. Interesting. So, well, I spent a few years at the Chicago Board of Trade. I grew up on a farm, so I get the whole kind of illiquid part of it. Hamayan, your background is in which commodities? Uh, I've, I've traded in mostly metals, and hence the name Metalex, um, Metal Exchange. Um, but um, I traded mostly with uh, iron ore, steel, um, steel raw materials, and some uh, base metals like uh, aluminium, zinc, and copper. And so that's, that's the, the background I have. And, and, and it became very apparent that, you know, there, there's a lot of other uh, metals, other commodities, which are uh, thinly traded, which have no huge liquidity. And it, it's quite difficult to actually get an exposure or a hedge against. Right. Uh, no, I, I get it. They're like those in the ag commodities too. So, how would this benefit, um, let's say, a, a farmer or somebody in the industry, in the metal industry or, or whatever, um, a trader, and then like, and somebody who's involved in like institutional trading, like what benefit would Metalex give them? So, so the biggest benefit here is, 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 is quite interesting that you, um, you can create the instrument you want yourself. You don't have to rely on somebody else to do it. So you can log on and you can you can say, okay, I, I want uh, an exposure between wheat. I want to create a spread between wheat and oil, for example. And you can you can take those two indices and you can create that spread. So rather than uh, taking wheat as a separate commodity and uh, buying a long or a short exposure on that commodity and doing the same with oil, what you can do is you can create a spread. Now, what does that do? What it does is actually your margin uh, requirements reduce dramatically. Uh, so you don't need that huge amount of margin for two separate commodities. Uh, you, you're taking exposure on one spread. So your margin is down. Your margin call is down because you suddenly now have a spread where you have this upper and lower limit where if you go beyond the floor and the cap, uh, you know it will settle. And you can create your own exposure. You can create your own instrument and your own product. And, mm -hmm. and then you can actually uh, go and buy the exposure uh, and sell the exposure. And you can actually be hedged uh, instantly, effectively. And you, and, and you trade with, uh, with the smart contract, which is run by uh, autonomous market makers. So you don't actually need um, 
the other side or the, the counterparty, uh, so which then uh, takes away the risk of the counterparty as well. Okay. Oh, that's fascinating. Um, so how does somebody get started or how can they check this out and see if this is something they'd like to explore? So we, we will be launching um, a, a beta phase in October, first, first, second week of October. We are uh, currently going to launch with um, roughly uh, 12 kind of commodity spreads, which would include things like iron ore, which would include like uh, some of the, the more uh, exotic ones like cobalt, uh, uranium perhaps, and, uh, and then some more uh, technology oriented like your uh, compute cycle costs. So you can actually hedge your computational cost for for a year for six months which and again the the cost of equipment which means you know you can you can take an exposure on a battery for example battery components so so you can take exposure on things which you haven't been able to till now so we will open that beta phase and we're inviting uh, multiple different traders uh, different physical traders uh, commodity traders futures traders to uh, come and try it out and see how they feel and, and give us some feedback. So by end of October, we'll be announcing that. Okay, and they can go to, what is the website or how do they sign up for the beta phase? Yeah, so the, uh, the website is called uh, metalex.com and uh, you, can, you can access it via fetch.ai or you can do it via metalex, which is M-E-T-T-A-L-E-X.com. Okay. Well, that's very interesting um, because like I said, I've spent some time in the commodity markets and around them. And this sounds like it's a market for things that have not been traded in the past. So that makes that more of a market. And then also it's uh, kind of updated for the future. You mentioned computer parts too. So it's it's the futures market kind of for the future. We're bringing the old commodities into the new world. Um, Yes. in its archaic phase of trading, so this, okay. this should change. Very interesting. All right, well, check it out. Thank you, Humayun, for joining us and explaining Metalex for us. Always a pleasure. Thank you very much. Uh-huh.